My dad was a professional football player and wanted a son, and he had me. So I was my dad's son. I went hunting and fishing and camping every weekend. I knew that I was different than the other sons of other fathers at the fishing and hunting camps because if I hit my thumb with a hammer, it was okay for me to cry. But those other sons, they had to suck it up. My mom uh, was in the fashion industry. And when my mom got her hands on me, I was spiffed up in dresses. One day, my dad came to me and he said, you know, you're getting older, you're eight years old. Maybe you should spend more time with your mom doing girl things. He couldn't have said anything more inflammatory to me. I just was enraged. I couldn't understand why I had to choose one or the other. My life was just great. And at the end of the discussion, my dad said to me, well, I guess if you're willing to work hard, you can do anything you want. And I said, okay, I'm gonna be an engineer was the malest thing I could think of as a career. And then, sadly, my dad passed away a few years later. It was a huge shock to me. Having told my dad that I wanted to be an engineer and gotten his support for that, there was no way that I wasn't going to carry through on that. I would want him to have been proud of me. And so that allowed me to navigate through all of the cultural advice that I was getting, which was so inappropriate. For example, why do you want to take calculus? You're just going to grow up and have babies. There was no way I was going to wimp out. I had to have that degree.